of a Dallas man who died while climbing Mount Hood is back from an emotional journey. Karen James was visiting a child who was born the same day her late husband Kelly was found dead on Mount Hood. She met that little girl in Zambia, and NBC 5's Meredith Land has her emotional journey. In a small African village in Zambia, no one has heard Karen James's tragic story. Her husband, Kelly James, a mountain climber from Dallas, died on Mount Hood almost four years ago, along with two other climbers. At the time, the world watched as rescue crews tried desperately to find them, but sadly found Kelly James's body in a self-made snow cave December 17th. Her birthday is very spe special to me because where rescue workers couldn't rescue him. What led her here? Karen sponsored a child through World Vision. My four-year-old little girl uh, named Abigail is that her birthday is uh, December 17th, 2006, the same day that they found Kelly in the snow cave. Um, when I saw her, I just, uh, my heart just pretty much melted because I, I knew she was supposed to be my sponsored child. It wasn't until I uh, looked at the picture of Kelly and I looked over at her that the whole life cycle hit me. Her other mission since Kelly's death, raising money to bring clean water to children by drilling deep water wells. Karen and Jennifer Smith are two of the five women who formed ifyouknew.org and they took the 30 minute walk to the water with the women of this village. When I realized that they did that five times a day, I thought there is no way I can carry it at the way I carry it that many times and I wasn't even worthy to walk in their shoes. Karen was there when this village hit water with one of those drills. Everybody's singing and dancing, they're singing with you and it, it's just um, because they realize it's life. Through Abigail, Karen says she's learned true joy. Even though I had all the gifts and I'm sponsoring her, she's given me much more than I'll ever give her. And in Africa, ultimately gained closure. What it does for your own heart and your own joy is just off the charts. It is um, giving back, really, is the best medicine for the soul. Meredith Land, NBC5.